Well folks, this is the first installment of CP Garage and we're unboxing a Hero Cut 35 plasma cutter. This has been toted as the cheapest plasma cutter on Amazon and uh, Canadian wise it was $199. So, uh, and funny enough, the price of the 110 volt versus the 220 was uh, some of the same price. So we'll start opening it up and uh, see what we have inside. Again, nice small little unit, a little bit of styrofoam there. Take a look at the size of that thing. That's uh, quite the little unit. I'd say it's smaller than a briefcase. Certainly well put together. Yeah, that's pretty small. Yeah, and in contrast, that's uh, there's the hand, and that's the size of the unit. So I'm not sure exactly uh, how well this thing's going to work, but that'll be the next video. So when you look at it, you get your current, and you got the adapter for the whip, as well as your ground. Looks pretty good. On the back, certainly got your air in, your power, and your mounting points for the uh, for the regulator. And uh, well, for 220, that's a pretty small wires, uh, as you can see. Uh, but uh, we may have to beef that up a little bit, but clearly uh, it is marked uh, 220 volts, so this is the right one. Let's see what else we've got here. One other box. Great little uh, instruction manual, and the uh, yeah, nice thing is, it's in English, so uh, I don't have to worry about trying to decipher some pictures. Uh, let's see what's in this little box here. Okay, so we've got our air hose to hook up. Well, they did furnish us with a plug, although uh, I'm not real fussy for those size plugs. I'll probably have to beef that up a little bit. Well, here we go with our ground clamp. Not too bad, it's got a little bit of strength to it. Should ground out, but uh, and again, another short little cord. Oh, we got. Uh, some various clamps and consumables, uh, as well as uh, a little adapter for the compressor, and it's the right one that I use, so that's good to know. The consumables look interesting, and by the way, just because I know that consumables can be hard to get, I ordered up a package of consumables, and uh, actually came really quick, and there's only like $25 for enough of the cups and all those pieces. So that's that piece. Here's the business end of it. Then heard in the uh, noise of the packaging. Well, well shielded. Certainly got that Chinese smell to her. Okay, and this is considered the PT31 torch head. So when you're looking for your consumables, certainly that's the one you want to look for. Oh, that fell apart. Ready. <laughs> so anyhow, when you look at your consumables, your it's fairly simple enough. So we'll put that back together a little later. Nice little trigger guard there for your switch. And again, enough you know, for your air and for your electricity. So that's that one. more pieces for the consumables here. What's in this great little box here? Oh yes. There is your regulator and mount for your compressed air. And again, you got to keep in mind that it's got to be super dry. So I run everything through all my tools and everything through a dryer um, just to make sure that it doesn't gum up my tools. So putting this through dry air is not going to be a problem. 
So, all in all, that is a nice little, uh, nice little setup. And it'll go well on the welding cart. Again, you take a look at her. Um, she's a cute little rig. We'll see what she'll cut. Uh, but we won't do that today. I'll uh, get her all set up and got a new plug. Uh, got a new plug put in the garage. And uh, we'll give this a test out, but that'll be another video for another day. So if you wouldn't mind, uh, certainly appreciate if you put some comments down below. And if you want to see more videos, again, uh, I do have to uh, stress that I'm, one, I'm not sponsored by Hero Cut at all. Um, I just uh, wanted a new plasma cutter for the garage. So I uh, went out and bought this one. But uh, you know, certainly willing to kind of show you what it is if you're going to look at it. And uh, stay tuned for the next video when I get it all hooked up and we'll give it a we'll give it a go. All right, anyhow, that's uh, that's all we have for today. Thanks for stopping NCP Garage and uh, stay tuned for the next video.